Oh, too bad. Oh, oh no! <laughs> You're alive. Calling me out. You, yeah, it's hot. <laughs> Called you out. Ha, no. Ha, 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 ha. no, no. Oh no. Send help. <laughs> Don't worry. I'm sure plans can be made as far as you go up. I can make plans. <laughs> you can make. You yeah, know. That's fair. You can make plans. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, oh, Shy. So How's it going? Hey, Shy. Ah. Oh, my okay. goodness. Okay. So. No. Oh. <laughs> your cookies, damn it. Welcome back to the Eternal Rift. Technically, <laughs> these guys are still on the boat, but I didn't want them to have to load a map within 10 minutes of the stream, so I just kind of load them into the base pre map. Ignore this. Um, <laughs> the boat. Yeah. So they. <laughs> Basically, we're heading into dock in a- I had- why did I close that? <laughs> Box. In, in a place called Arcton. Uh, so, the the last episode, they kind of just sat around and RP'd a lot. <laughs> and needed to repair their ship. It's fine. Eh, it's only a minor damage. Eh, you know, enough to get, go in to not take that's another fine. hit like that, basically. Oh, that's fine. We can take about five more. Oh, I'm I'm sure. But, mm. So, if you guys don't have anything planned while you're heading in, we will probably Ooh. start as you guys are kind of just on the docks. Uh. Mm hmm. If you I want to get uh, off the boat for a bit, I imagine almost does. <laughs> yep. Well, first. I'll, I'll first. Just, uh, yes. He would be asking Voldero mm -hmm. if she needs anything picked up. Mm -hmm. He will, he will, that way she doesn't get lost in the city because, no. Either that or to take with him. Uh. I guess she needs to pick up any supplies or anything on the, uh... At most, she might ask you to see if you could find any, like, strange components to things for spells. Because she actually uses a component pouch for hers. Mm. But well, see, other or than he, that... Or he, could take, or he could take her with him. Like, on right on the shoulder, stuff like that. You got Keldor following. You can, you can take her. If you, if you offer, she will accept that offer. Which I need to pull him out of the bag because this is yeah. a different save. Where the hell is she? Yes. Oh, there. there. Yes. Mm -hmm. there she was. You were, oh. you were right. She was over there. Yes. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, I will say this. I do have one question. From mm -hmm. the time it took me to not become an animal <laughs> and wear my off <laughs> and getting on a dog, how long has it been? Uh, you guys would have. You guys probably saw it about a short rest time out, so you would have had time to do a rest if you needed to. Yeah, yeah I have all my wild shapes. <laughs> nice. Now nice. I can do more animal shit. I have death. Because I imagine you guys could, like, look through spy glasses and stuff and have seen it. Yeah. That's how they knew they were getting closer. Yeah. Woo. Yeah. Get your at, straight together, we gotta go. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> at some point, um, Krez going uh, would go up to uh, uh, Zarvis mm -hmm. and basically ask if he had some free time later today if he'd be willing to chat for a bit. Mm -hmm. Oh my. <laughs> yeah, oh my. He, he would. He would definitely uh, be willing to do that with you if there's an opportunity. All right. So. Cinder so just quiet as soon as we get the docks. Is like looking in every direction. Yeah, it's flat on the docks, but you notice that as it goes onto the terrain, it just kind of shoots up like a mountain. <laughs> Uh, and there are like, there are up. no lava rivers here per se. There probably are some further like out of town. <laughs> but 
but it definitely just looks like a cliff face that you... It looks kind of shiny. You're not sure why mm, it's shiny. Kind of shiny. Mm, shiny. Hmm. <laughs> oh, oh. Uh oh. We lost the rusty. Oh no! Yeah, I'll do. I'll, I'll, I'll. It's fine. Uh, we have somebody listening in on our chat, so the, the, that if you're wondering <laughs> what's going on, stream. <laughs> Don't worry. About it. E. It's fine. The uh, is a spectator okay. She, she, she's just listening straight on stream for now oh, because sure. Discord is cutting in and out for her. So. Oh, okay. Uh, that's her. Uh. Yeah, Cinder, Cinder is doing her best not to just go bolting. Oh, please mm -hmm. do. <laughs> please don't. That would be fucking hilarious. You she, know? It depends on how long they stay here, how long she can keep this. <laughs> but she's like... What's that? What's that? What's that? So, yeah, it's Ooh, fine. You'll find it. out what's wrong with that. <laughs> Later, I'm sure. But what do you guys do? As you just stand there on the docks. Mm. I kind of marked what little bit of is there. It's not a big town. Mm. It's just like a little seaport. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Um. <laughs> sudden, oh. sudden change just... <laughs> You're at a 45 degree mm -hmm. angle, Snowflake. <laughs> mm -hmm. Which probably looks really weird to the people still flat. <laughs> Cinder like places her foot on, but still stands on a dock. Kind of, it's like. Mm -hmm. Zarvis is watching you too, like, trying not to laugh. <laughs> Oh, why is the ground shiny, Cinder? Can I do a nature check? You may. I love that he has Cinder. That is adorable. <laughs> uh, Kindling's going to, like, lick the ground and do the help. <laughs> <laughs> you know? <laughs> wow. Oh, it's wow. tasting it. <laughs> I got something. Oh my oh, goodness. What is my nature? He's actually oh, oh, you can. So it's a 16. Ooh. A 16? Yeah. Uh, you realize as you're like feeling the ground and everything, it's very slick. Hmm. Running might not be the best idea. I mean. <laughs> Do I know if it's like, like, like in a. Uh, I mean, as a player, the thing I, first thing I can think of is a sitting glass. Uh, it doesn't really tell me what it's actually made yeah, of. It just says just it's just a rock. slick surface. Slick basically. surface like rock. rock, yeah. yeah. Fun. Yeah. She'll, she'll say that. She'll, uh, I don't know what it is, but it's slick. Don't run. Oh, she kind of looks a little disappointed as she says that. <laughs> oh. Oh, wait, damn. Oh, that's going to make life so very interesting. I did not impose. Don't, Goliath, don't run. Yeah, I, I, as, that their main mode of transportation is running. <laughs> as as player knowledge, I did not impose the disadvantage of walking at half movement. So you still mm. have your full movement. You just probably not a good idea to literally run to places. Dashing is bad. Basically. Dashing is bad. Yes. <laughs> um, I'm I'm curious how well that would work for something that has like a climb speed or something like that. You know. Good question. It's a slick rock, so I will have to figure. Uh, we'll have to find out because I feel like I might find out at some point. <laughs> Good or bad, I might find that out at some point. <laughs> you know. <laughs> I'm sure it's fine. So what are we doing here? Hmm. Just exploring. Uh, about... uh, do we have anything else Ooh. we're doing? I don't know about you guys. I'm planning to visit the tavern or something. See how far or see if word spread here. Mm. Oh. Right, we are technically fugitives. Oh, what? <sighs> fugitives, runaways, people that have uh, quote unquote broken the law. 
and ran away from it. What? <laughs> You're laughing! Sorry, guys. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't broken a lava. We're having hmm? things pinned on us, aren't we? Pinned. It means yes, somebody is sense. saying you're doing these stuff, these things, even though you are being aren't. blamed. Yes. They're mean. Yes, they are. Just kind of crawls a bit. Right. We also were going to look, uh, see if they had any information on, uh, yeah, our group. Yeah, this place is probably the tavern to start. Mm -hmm. Alright, then we go to the tavern. Okay. If you guys want to take care of that, I'll go with Valdira and help get some supplies for her stuff. All right, uh, let's try not to make a big splash here. The last thing we need is more people running us out of town. Is it a good idea to split splash? up? Either? At, the, at the very least, we can do a buddy system thing. Mm -hmm. Agreed so on that. Slightly steps toward. Excuse me, while I turn off my fan because I forgot to do this. <laughs> <laughs> Beep. <laughs> Beep. I, I have a remote. Explore. <laughs> yeah, why don't uh, at least at least a group of three? I think will be good. <laughs> so there looks at who else wants to join. We have three. Oh, I tried. Yeah, you have Baldera with you. I didn't see a Baldera because she was on her cloak and I didn't see her. She's tiny. I mean, she's, she's like on her shoulder or something like that. She's and, a and gnome. Like... She's so oh, tiny. Oh, wait. Nubby on one side, Baldera on the other. Right. One, two. We have four. Five. Okay, yeah, you're technically counting the animals here. Because <laughs> <You're sure>? <laughs> she would count the animals. <laughs> Nubby's just there. Right, so. Dangling. You know, she makes a good point. We've split into a team of five each. <laughs> Technically. Can like puffs up. Like on a pearl uh, puff. Do I know that spell? <laughs> I do. I know message, so if we get into trouble, I'll let some of you guys know. But okay. uh, let's try not to do that. I do not have this spell. I don't either. Oh, that's probably fine. I can summon animals. Yeah. Send one a, send a little bird if you guys get into trouble, alright? I can summon more nubbies. <laughs> Maybe not a great idea. <laughs> okay. Oh. Uh, also, as a side note, I did end up pre uh, preparing something in place of sanctuary. Hmm. Oh. Fairy fire. Ooh. Oh, fuck. It's fine, I have a problem. What? He has an addiction you really to that want spell. spell to work. That fire that I, that is a really good spell. It's a good spell hey, if you're not works, fighting dex great. things. Yeah. 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 It's, fair. it's also really good against things that like to go invisible. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. yeah. It's fine. I just it's one of those things to go in. Okay, how do I science I know how I science it. I'm going to start <laughs> using it. Glitter bomb. Yep. Oh, you don't have kitty on this one. Oh, I probably hey. did I not? I thought I put him on this save. He should have been on the main save. Where'd he go? Oh no. Kitty? Kitty? Kitty, Kitty come back! The kitty has gone where the fuck the cat wants. It's a cat! <laughs> oh <laughs> god! Did Was I put the it? ship the main save? No, this is the main this save, but I could. I thought I put him on there because I have all uh, the other tokens on here, but maybe I do. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Unless it's. I will. I will. Remedy this just it, it might be around the board. It was also stupid tiny. You know oh, yeah. Fluffy, get out of my bag. <laughs> I was checking your bag to see if it was in there. I didn't see it though. Let me see which Thank one it was you. named under here. Get in the god go. Yeah, you, have to, you have to drop it like directly on the top of it. Drop it like well, it's hot. Got well, it. Well someone yep. can't do that. Yeah. Ah, uh, right. Because it drops on the search window, but if you don't have the search window, you don't have access to it. 
Nope. You know? As it freezes everything. <laughs> oh, of I try to. Saving. But no, it's not responding. While I'm trying oh, to import oh, this now. Yeah. Yeah, By the, the way, I hate this whole found one matching thing because I have a box or a bag of infinite like blank ones, and it keeps mm. wanting to change the blank ones to match the one I just changed every time. Yeah, mm. that is yeah. new, and I hate it. Yeah, that's very new, and I did. Yeah, that reminds me. Oh, hey, that works apparently. Kitty, <gasps> is it working <laughs> again? It's oh, it is. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> they they it. Thank you, tabletop. We fixed it. I can do this again. <laughs> oh right. goodness! All right. Anyways, if you can't tell uh, that was broken at one point. <laughs> it was. <laughs> it was very broken. All right. Wow, having fun with the lights up the token. So we head out. Yeah, that is right. Seems like yeah. um, Let's try and find ourselves a tavern. Cinder kind of does a salute. The uh, question is, are you just wandering around randomly, or are you going to try to find somebody to ask? <laughs> if you're talking to Cinder, Cinder is planning on wandering randomly. <laughs> Bo both groups, technically, yes. Because it's going to take these guys uh, a little longer to get to the tavern, because the shop area is by the dock. Well, mm. I imagine he... <laughs> Because a lot of, I see, okay, as player, I see the potion shop yeah. listed. It's um, just which, for my reference more than anything. You know, <laughs> see, well, the reason I was saying that is because the majority of uh, alchemical com components are also sometimes used as spell components. Mm. Um, so he may look for like magic shop, potion shop, something like that, knowing that some components are shared between the two. Mm. What do you want, pooch? makes it easier. Yeah. So you can tell this over here is like a blacksmith. Mm -hmm. uh, because yeah. uh, it would be more open. Mm-hmm. You can see that smoke for miles. Yeah. <laughs> for miles. You just haven't you walked around to where the technical miles. front of the potion shop is yet to see that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Because nobody else really knows what supplies she's looking for, so they haven't... Mm -hmm. They don't really have a reason mm -hmm. to point it out. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Yeah. Okay. So there's just kind of just dancing in place with it, basically. Yeah, so what is, what does this group do to see how long it takes them to actually find the tavern? Because it's uh, obviously I can only draw so much. The town's probably a little bit bigger yeah. than it actually is. Yeah. Uh, probably. I'm not opposed to asking directions. Yeah, I feel like that would be a <laughs> smart bet would be to ask, like, hey, where's the nearest tavern? It shouldn't be that precarious to do so. <laughs> so which bard asks? I mean, you, you're you literally right by the dock manager. You could ask him. Yeah, let's do that. Yeah, so okay. You ask him where, where it is, and he basically tells you to go through the, the district. He gives you more accurate directions, but he goes through, go through the district, and you'll see, like, the neighborhoods, and then you'll turn right, mm -hmm. and you'll find it. Okay. Because you, you can easily tell what are our houses and what are shops. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Which, there are a lot more houses. This is just where they start. <laughs> mm. Like a yeah, whole no. neighborhood type of thing. The, but yeah, mm. you will notice that all these places are built into the mountain, so the actual shops are made of the rock. Yeah, and no. Noise. And it is flat when you go into the shops because of how they built it. Ah, uh, so they have terraced the fuck into the place, gotcha. Yeah. Mm -hmm. They basically made, like, a little, like, entryway for you to step on, and then you yeah. can go in. Um, as our group is making the way to the tavern, a Snowflake is just going to kind of just hone in on her arcane senses and just try to pick up on anything that's super magical as they walk through. Yeah, I imagine I she's know. using the other token. I don't think I moved that one either because I added it while we were doing the other one. It's fine. Uh, no worries. This is good. I'm just going to assume that she, she's still in that form. Uh, Yeah, sure. If not, you are more than welcome. Uh, yeah. 
That'll be that'll be a little bit before she adapts because she just arrived. Yeah. yeah, she it's not so much adapting at this point. She's just trying to see if there's anything like super magical, like not so much adapting with the land, but oh, seeing shit, if I'm there's like screen. something of great <laughs> magic like in a house that they're passing. She's just like kind of just tuning in to like just like You do as you pass by the potion shop realize there's a lot of uh arcane magics in there. Okay. Um it doesn't seem like any of the other buildings that you're passing by, though, have that uh, issue. There will be, uh, you know, roll me an, an arcana check. Just for shits and giggles to see if you sense this. Shits and giggles. Shits and giggles. Shoots and ladders. Yes. Uh, the 17. 17? You do sense... A magical presence in this town that seems to surround the town but you can't pinpoint what it is hmm. Hmm. Interesting. and it seems to extend pretty far enough to probably cover the entire town yeah she's gonna be on a little bit of alert that is fair yeah. That's a fair response. It gives you a very uneasy feeling for some reason. Yeah. Oh. yeah. Even more unfair. You know. <laughs> yeah, you can just assume that snowflakes just Because you're more alert yeah, because you're more aware of these kinds of things. Mm -hmm. The DC I, I would probably have like special DCs for you. Or more sensitive, I guess the word I want. There you go. She's going to be just on high alert uh, the entire time they're here. So, so what is this right. little group doing um, besides going do and letting her buy her components really fast? Do I notice that Cinder is like looking around, like just staring at everything, like distracted? I'm just going to move oh, you guys uh, over here she's not hiding for it. now. Right, fair. Until uh, she's very, after you. This is all new to her. Reason I was asking mostly, you know, she Amos in Gnomish to Valdira would ask as far as what kind of supplies she needs. Like, you know, knowing as far as she needs stuff as far as component wise for spells and things like that. But if there was anything else as far as uh, component wise or something like that, she needed. Uh. <laughs> Not specifically. She just was doing okay. restock, basically. Fair. That's fine. Okay. Or for hey. the spells that she knows. Type of thing. They would go. They'd go over to the dock manager as well. A is and ask. You know, essentially the same thing. Uh, well, not about the tavern, but uh, yeah. Would ask where. Yeah. So he like, he point you. Or something would be. He point you to the the potion shop. Um, he's not sure what's at the general goods store, but he will point you in that direction. Because they get okay. so much random inventory there. Fair. Fair, fair. And then he... It depends on if they have any supply, but he does say that the smith might have some magical, like, weapons or stuff like that. Gotcha. Okay. Okay. Yes, to. I had a list... And I don't know where it is anymore, but it's fine. Oh, I'll no. come up with a random <laughs> list uh, at some point. Oh, no. But yeah. So that, that's really all she's doing. She's not really yeah. doing anything special. It'll take mm -hmm. a few minutes at most for her to get the stuff. Because she just hands a list over. <laughs> yeah. uh -oh. And I assume if we go into the potion shop, Cinder's looking at everything. That is fair. <laughs> fair. That is very, very fair. Also, out of character real quick. I'm so sorry, Shy. <laughs> if we were the group <laughs> rescuing you, I'm so sorry. Uh, wait, yeah. <laughs> yeah, find all the different supplies you need in there. If not, go to the general goods store. Um... Yeah, she probably wouldn't actually think to check there because usually they wouldn't have the supplies she'd want. Fair. Are there any right, interesting potions? 
Uh oh. You know, let me see. Because <laughs> oh, no. she's just kind of looking at it and looking if there's like any like titles on them or anything like that, or just looking that looks interesting. Let's let's come here, random Google. <laughs> <laughs> of professionalism. Mm, Google. Google, Google gives all the good things. Fine. She's got some gold to spend. Oh, she doesn't dear. buy much. Mm -mm. I mean, the most she might buy would be like an enchanted like a shield, but I don't have enough money for that. I can guarantee you that. So you see quite a few different potions. Uh, I'm assuming you're going to want to check to see what they are. Oh, yeah. I mean, you can gather which ones are the healing potions. There's a, there's a couple yeah. healing potions there, but there's a few others that are just different colored. She'd probably be like, what's this? And what's this one? And what's this one? <laughs> uh. <laughs> oh boy. Good luck, Amos. Fine. <laughs> 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 you have two energetic ones with you. I know. <laughs> He's just glad to be off the boat at the moment. That's fair. That's a potion that exists that I'm gonna have to work with because it's an older one and it's be rewarded a lot, but I like it. <laughs> oh no. Do I even wanna know? Nope, nope. I didn't want to be surprised when it if it comes up. I have to I have to like actually rework it because it's an older it's like a three point uh, five version. Gotcha. Fair. Uh -oh. Yeah. Yeah, you do see a uh, a yellow one and a and a green one mixed in with all the healing stuff. Should probably like, bring them up and kind of like like just ask the person what did you do. Uh, they, to because I'm lazy and not going to RP it, <laughs> uh, they explain that one is a potion of speed, Ooh. and the other one is a uh, resistance to fire, or not fire, acid. Bleh, I'm good. I rolled to see what was in there. Or so. <laughs> so, resistant to acid damage. She looks at animals. Do we need... Uh, any- do, do, we, do we need a resistance to acid? Uh, I don't think so. Could anyone be fa need to be faster? Uh... <laughs> Here? <don't> no. Know. <laughs> okay, to be fair, almost as movement speed is 35 feet. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he has haste on himself, I it's 70. I kind of almost want to get the speed just because I want to drink the speed potion and then turn into a fucking light panther. <laughs> oh, bro, I actually found a price list. Ah. Yes. Mm. I'll have to send that nice. there. It is just straight up magic item prices. Nice. Oh, God, that, oh, God, that would be. I'm going yeah. to post that in my little nah thing. Oh, okay. There. But uh, yeah. How much is the speed one? Uh, let me see. That's what I'm currently looking for. Because is there a search? There is a search. Ha ha! Ooh. Ooh. Nice. I love it when there's a search function. And you can put a minimum and maximum cost, too. Yeah. Ooh. Mm -hmm. The 400 gold. That's how much that costs. <laughs> she kind of looks at her for, uh, the little coins she's got. Do you have any basic healing potions? And how much of those? Uh, She'll probably set the bowl potions. Those are... Basic. Those are 50. She'll grab one of the basic healings and she'll put it down. And she'll put down the dig gold. Oh, alright. And I will mark that. Goes from 76 to not that... <laughs> I love this, that it actually gives accurate prices. Because <laughs> I've looked them up separately before, 
But it's nice to have a full list. Uh oh. Hello. Am I here? Mm, yes. Yeah. yes. Hey. Oh. Sorry. I don't know if anybody could hear me. Yes. Yeah. I was I was trying to do math in my head. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> That's fair. I was like, how does 76 minus 50? <laughs> this is the most expensive. Oh, God. The Holy expensive. Avenger is what's the most expensive item in D&D. Holy, <laughs> Holy crap. Oh. It's 165,000. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> All right. So she has one basic healing potion. Hey. She smiled. Is there anything else we need from Amos? Uh, I think that might be it. I'm good. I think that might be it. We're not shopping anywhere else. We should probably find them. Yeah, mm -hmm. it might be a good thing. All right. So you guys do that. Yeah, we'll head in that direction. Yeah. Okay. So this group, while well, they catch up, uh, make perception checks. Snowflake, make it with advantage because you were on alert. Okay. Oh crap! We're making perception checks. Yes. Yeah. I hate us. Sorry, I stuck a stuck in my face face with ice cream. Um, no, no. For ice cream. <laughs> I'm gonna get some later. Uh, Alright, um. Perception. Oh, yeah. Ooh, that's actually pretty decent! I might actually Those two aren't good. paying fucking attention, oh, apparently. Yeah. You know. <laughs> it was a four to five on the die, they're not paying attention. Oh, hey! Hey! Hee <laughs> hee. <laughs> yeah, the three of Wait. you. A spiral 20? <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Listen. <laughs> so, don't, don't, don't come at me like mouth. this. There will, there don't will come be at me like this while I'm at my friend's place. Come on. <laughs> so, three of you notice this as you're walking past to go to the tavern because you're looking around, kind of. Uh, there is a. Uh, what would it be called? I, I know what it's called, but my mind is blanking. God damn it. Uh, describe <laughs> what it is. Bounty board? No. <laughs> Gu gulags? Oh. Uh, <laughs> no gula I don't know. I just started throwing out random words. I have no idea. <coughs> uh, uh, I don't know what it's called, but you you kind of glance over because you notice something out of the corner of your eye. And you see two skeletal remains hanging here. Mm. Oh, gallows? Yellow. Gallows, that's what it was. I couldn't remember the name. I knew it before, but I yeah. just like blanked out. That's not disturbing. And you know, I'm sure that's fine. Miss Snowflake. Hmm. You do sense like some of the, uh, a much larger concentration of that uneasy feeling is coming from that spot. Huh? Interesting. Now that you are closer to it. Okay. She's gonna make note of it and then she's gonna do something whenever they go into the bar. That's fair. <laughs> so yeah. You guys head inside? Mm -hmm. Don't see any reason not to. Indeedly. Yeah. I think. Yeah, he's probably just gonna stand like there. Uh, yeah. I just so made a random token for this because fucking barkeep. Of course. Can't have a tavern without a barkeep, you know. God damn it. I'm not doing that accent for barkeep. <laughs> That's perfectly fair. Trish the dish? <laughs> yes. Absolutely. <laughs> oh my goodness, you guys. Cookie Monster Barkeep? Thank you. How can I help you? Mm. 
Oh, oh shit, uh, Mouse, why'd you freaking flip? I got flowing help. <laughs> <laughs> uh, right. We love it when that happens. Uh, I got any cider here. Uh, yeah, be a silver. Let's just pull it, pull it out right. for you. All right. As I do conversions. Hmm? And a 51. Buy oh, cheap drinks. Helps if numpad is on. <laughs> yeah. Ah, uh, D&D, where you buy Nine. the cheap booze to get drunk. <laughs> ten, ten copper equals one what, gold. Man. Equals one gold. Ten gold equals ten, ten gold equals one platinum. Yeah. And if you use Electrum, what the fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> I'm not converting that shit. <laughs> you know. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh yeah, she's just gonna get her ale, at, or her cider, not ale, mm -hmm. and kind of take up a place like here-ish, mm -hmm. and just keep an ear out for anything going on in here, unless we're the only ones in here. Uh, I mean, there's probably, there's a few patrons kind of sitting around, right. just drinking. I will keep an ear out on those patrons. It's, it seems to be just general chatter. A couple drunks. Mmm, drunks. She looks at the rest of you. I would like to try two new things here at this bar. Well, it helps. One beverage, one food. It, it helps to know what you haven't tried. Uh, everything. Uh, she looks confused! <laughs> Surprise me. Uh, oh. That's never a good thing. She do. looks at Cam! <laughs> how, do I, uh, how do I respond to this look? <laughs> what do you like? Typically, what I end up doing when I go to a new place, Snowflake, is I ask for the local best. What is the local favorite? Looks back at bartender. I would like the local favorite drink and food, please. Right. <laughs> that quote popped up. So she'll kind of yell back to the kitchen to make up some food that I'll make up at some point. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and she'll hand you a a drink which I did not prepare names for these because I didn't prepare for this <laughs> you know? sorry I keep doing that it's gonna hurt you it's a tasty beverage <laughs> and a sorry. yummy plate of food that's all we need it is it is it is not like a super strong alcohol it just seems to be flavored like to mm. taste really good thank you how much uh, of this Shiny thing in my pocket do I need to give you? Uh, in total, about five silver for both. Okay, she will do that. Uh, and then... He's just gonna sit down. <laughs> she, Snowflake, is going to grab her plate of food. And her happy little tankard. Hmm? And she is going to... Uh, go over here. Hmm. Do you mind if I sit with you, Cray? Have at it. And she's gonna go over here. And she's gonna pretend like she's eating. <laughs> and she's gonna send Kitty out. Okay. Mm -hmm. And she's going deaf and blind. <laughs> Zara's gonna watch the cat leave. <laughs> As the cat you know. leaves, cat does like a around <laughs> his legs, does like a little figure eight, and then leaves. <laughs> <laughs> That's adorable. That's very adorable. But yeah, uh, and you can imagine where she's gonna. Yeah. She's going there. And you, dear. Well, probably whatever you would recommend, and. Possibly the local gossip? Ah, it depends on what you will, what type of gossip you're looking for. Recent news. We've been out at sea for a while. Need to know what's been going on. Recent news? Nothing new here other than the damn curse. 
curse. Mm -hmm. Oh, please enlighten me. I am very, very intrigued now. Uh, simple story is a few months ago, people began falling ill. Nobody could figure out why until they died from it. Hmm. And then came back. Well, that doesn't sound very good. No, most of the locals don't like it when a relative or loved one tries to eat their face. Hmm, prefer my dead relatives to stay dead. Hmm. As does most of this town, unfortunately, we have to literally kill our dead as soon as they die, which is a really ironic statement. Hmm. That is not an easy place to... To be, I'm sure. Well, we have an idea of what's causing it. Unfortunately, everyone who's attempted to deal with the problem have disappeared. Really? Mm hmm. Now, did they just vanish or were they vanished? Pretty sure they were vanished. Somebody doesn't want them revealing what happened. Mm -hmm. Oh, I do so love an underbelly. Well, there's a family that lives about half an hour's walk along the coast. And she'll kind of point back behind her to show which direction. Mm -hmm. mm. They like to play around with darker magics. Hmm. Really the only lead we have, unfortunately, but since everyone keeps disappearing who tries to go investigate, we pretty much confirmed things. Oh, wow. And no one can get close enough to deal with the problem. Well, we wouldn't know. Since nobody ever comes back. Hmm. A lot of people have decided to avoid our town who have realized this. So, that's really the only thing going on here. Mm, well, that can't be good for business. Eh, the few locals that haven't ditched. She kind of looks up through the tavern. Are just trying to make a living and deal with it. Hope it passes over in time. If I know anything about curses, they don't just pass. Yeah, let them be optimistic. <laughs> Can't get through the day without hope. Mm-hmm. Unfortunately, well, we've not... had people come try to break whatever curse, but mm. Mm. it hasn't worked. Either it's too strong, or they just haven't figured out what it is. That's frustrating. And then the people that try and go confront the people that likely involved with the curse just disappear and... Well, mm -hmm. nothing is helpful. Yeah, everyone gave up trying to trying to confront them about a month ago. Hmm. A month ago. Mm-hmm. Out of character, real quick, because I think I'm making some connections that, like. Also, a month ago was when Zarvis left Celestia, right? About, yeah. Okay. People, this has been going on for about, she said a couple months, uh, I'd mm -hmm. say about three or four, close to four. Mm -hmm. 
now. Okay. So about when a lot of things are happening at the same time. Gotcha. That's not concerning at all. Yeah. It's fine. I'm sure that's completely normal. <laughs> Is it, or was this just coincidence? Who knows? Yeah. yeah. Uh -huh. <coughs> Cinder has no idea what's going on. <laughs> yep. <laughs> but it's going to go poorly. Mm -hmm. Yep. <sighs> Wow. Yeah, Zarvis definitely. She's definitely gotten his attention because of the undead. Com well, yeah, he figures yeah. undead. <laughs> well, you know, when the dead come back to life <laughs> and it's not in the good yeah. way, it typically means zombie of some sort. It's yeah, as soon as she fine. said she tried to eat your face, I think that was kind of the hint. <laughs> mm. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, he's and just... Krez over here and uh, with the eyebrow raise of, you know. <laughs> Hmm. Yeah. Whoever it is has dark magics and isn't far from town. That intrigues yeah. Kim so much. She's like, that's dangerous. Normally I wouldn't poke and pry, but like. Mm, sounds like, uh, like a whole uh, call to adventure to me. You know? <laughs> it's a bard's life. Mm hmm. It's a bard knock life for us. Wow. Well, you know. Sorry, your town's going through <clears throat> such a trouble. If we can safely figure out what's going on or help, I'm sure. Oh, if you can and figure out what's going on, I'm sure that you'll get a yeah. nice compensation for it. Well, we always enjoy that. I wish you luck if you do. <laughs> I will carry that luck with me. Well, if you don't have many travelers coming through, I don't know if you know what about the rest of the world, but if you know anything. Just thanks for a moment. Hmm. Nothing recent, as far as I can tell. Then again, we are kind of on the other side. So it might be a while before we get any word. Well, that is completely fair. Would you do me a favor? I've got a feeling we might be sticking around for a little while. If you do hear something before we head off, would you mind telling me? I will come and see if I can find you. <laughs> Much appreciated. She'll slide a gold piece over to her. She'll kind of grin and take it. I will definitely come find you. <laughs> <laughs> Cam yeah, knows how to speak no. bartender! <laughs> Thank you kindly. Business has been hard, man. She's gonna take a bribe. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you know? oh yeah. yeah. Oh no, definitely. I would. <laughs> Especially it's a gold piece. Good lord, that's a lot. That's a big one. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, because she's like, she's never. she's not gonna lie and say there's not those kinds of issues because if like a party mm -hmm. member dies or something, it turns into a zombie. <laughs> yeah. You know. You know. It might be a problem. Be even Might worse be. for business. <laughs> a little bit. And with that, Cam's just going to do a little finger wave and move herself over here. Oh, well, that was interesting. Well, nothing newsworthy from the world, which might bode well, but also considering we're very far from the center of it all. Mm, depends on how word travels. Mm hmm. You did get the bit about the undead. Oh, yeah. Please don't tell me that we're going to help. 
motions over to the cleric and then the uh, follower of the Raven Queen. Do you really think they're just going to leave this town the way it is? Right. Please don't tell me you're going to recruit me to help. <laughs> she just kind of folds her hands and rests her chin gently on her fingertips. Why wouldn't you want to help me? Because I don't want to disappear. Well, who said anything about disappearing? <laughs> he motions to the bartender? And uh. looks at her. Because <laughs> he was listening to the entire conversation. <laughs> uh, come now, where's your sense of adventure? Adventure is great. Preservation of life is better. <laughs> <laughs> yes, but see, you did make me a promise that you were going to look out for me now, didn't you? Uh, mm. <laughs> Don't twist my words. <laughs> oh, but they're such beautiful words, Kelljor. <laughs> I... <laughs> why do I? Why do I want Cinder just to pop in right at this moment to witness the bard off? That's <laughs> why I asked why I didn't chat with the. Oh, that is fair. They right do now. arrive just because of that, as he's like <laughs> trying. <sighs> I flustered him. I win. <laughs> Listen. <laughs> just exploding. <laughs> Can almost tell something is going on. Like as far as player asking of Yeah, he because at this point happened. he's just face palming and realizing he's been defeated. <laughs> She's got this biggest like grin on her face. <laughs> Round win. Yeah. Because he knows <laughs> that the way he worded it, he's fucked. <laughs> <laughs> um, you know, probably you kinda... most definitely recognize if he looked what sin uh what snowflake was doing yeah which by well, the way what the is moment... kitty cat doing well oh, no. we're gonna take a moment because they would be arriving and you would have investigated this while they were doing that so yeah kitty cat's being uh super sneaky mm -hmm. um and slowly approaching like the gallows area Mm -hmm. She's moving Mew in the direction that she felt was the most focal point of what she felt. So she's having little Mew go and trying to see if she can find an as, as close to an exact source of what she was sensing. You do, you do kind of go underneath uh, where they are, basically, where the two bodies are. And they look like they've been there for a very long time. You're not sure how long their, their skeletal remains at this point. You're not sure if that's because of the heat here, because there was definitely a temperature change. Uh, but there, you do sense that there are two points coming off of the bodies themselves and you do sense that there are other points in like different directions so it seems like whatever is set up is set up around the town and this might be the center like one of the other marks or whatever was left here okay but it's coming off of both bodies can sh can like the can mew crawl up to the top of the gallows where the bodies are? Yeah. And try to figure out where on the body it's coming from? It w It's actually coming from where their hearts would be. Would be? Well, there are their skeletal, skeletal veins. So yeah. 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 So it, it would be where, where a heart would be normally. Okay. If it's a skeletal remain, Mew's gonna stick head in ribcage. <laughs> 
Because that's uh, not gonna work. You just you because their 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 clothes are still technically intact. They're just tattered and stuff. Mm -hmm. You do see kind of like a a small dark energy coming off of that spot. Ooh, I don't think I have. Hold on. I have nothing for this current scenario. Touchy, touchy spells. Touchy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh no, she's gonna touch it. Well, at least it's no, just. The, I don't at think least I have the... any touch spells. That's the thing. I really yeah, don't it, think I, I do. will say at least it's the familiar touching it. <laughs> yeah. 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 Um, I don't feel like she has any touch spells at this point yet. Let me go to my notes where my wizard shit is. Uh, I don't no. think so. With no, all these cards, yeah. I mean, yeah, I don't know. She didn't get to hear it, but they, they have tried to remove the curse before. And yeah. it just hasn't been successful. Okay. It's possibly so, because it's such a wide range and it's so many points. They just haven't been able to discover every spot. Okay, so she can't even sense how many there are. She just senses many. She, yeah, they're just every direction. There seems to be points all around the town. Uh, okay. Mew's probably... Mew's not gonna, um... But for some reason, these bodies seem to be, like, the center point. Yeah, Mew's gonna crawl back out. Mm -hmm. Don't want to have any of that. And, uh, just as Mew, like, crawl... I imagine, like, like you said, there was, like, some tattered clothes. Imagine as, like, Mew's head comes out. Mm -hmm. Can Mew just do, like, just, like, a quick once around just to see if anybody's, like, watching... I, I imagine, like, Mew saw, like, Amos and Cinder walking into the tavern. Anybody watching? Uh... No. Nobody seems to be paying attention to that area. It seems like a lot of people try to avoid it. Like, they know it's coming from there. Oh, okay. They're kind of, they actually take, like, longer ways around when they go around, like, through. Okay. And Mew will go back, then. Kitty, kitty, kitty. Sneaks in through window. Oh, oh but, uh, looks at cat. <laughs> right. Yeah. As uh, as he would have walked in, by the way, mm -hmm. almost would would almost be able to tell as far as something was like. Oh no! Why? Why are you doing this kind of thing from Keldor? Yeah, he's just he just looks defeated. He just looks so defeated. <laughs> uh, and this you... reluctant look of like I really don't want to <laughs> L looks at Cam what did you do oh I just reminded Keljor of a promise he made that's fine no 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 what did you do <laughs> I have been recruited for something for what what are we doing well I stumbled across the rumor about the curse on the town Curse. Apparently, there are some undead roaming around, and we can't have that now, can we? Um, if I had to choose between the undead and the boat, I picked the boat. See, see, I'm not the and only I can't one. Swim. But there's undead on wait, the boat. What? Uh, oh, wait, what? Uh, wait. <laughs> wait, what? Zarvis looks up. What? <laughs> Shove piece Primal. of bacon in mouth. Uh, <laughs> um, snowflake. Wait, what? <laughs> um, that's uh, hmm. She doesn't know what she's talking about. Anyways, <laughs> I most certainly do. <laughs> Why are you making noise like a snake? <laughs> no, as a snake goes. Hmm. <laughs> Ha 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 ha! I'm gonna go get a drink, and he's just gonna get up. <laughs> Bye. Oh, this. She shrugs and keeps shoveling breakfast in the mouth. Uh, <laughs> so we got volunteers to deal with undead. Uh, uh -huh. Well, Zarvas, you tell me. Should we be poking nose in this, or should we just let this town deal with undead on its own? Well, personally, I'd. Uh... Want to try and figure out something? No. 
When you say they deal with it, do undead come to the town? No, their dead are turning into undead. They have to oh. kill their own family members. Oh, well that that's better. No, not really. Yeah, no, I I'm with the big guy. Can we not? <laughs> Vildera is like just bouncing on your shoulder, by the way. Yeah. He he we, yeah. <laughs> Between so we we don't they don't know why? Oh, they have a pretty decent idea of who's causing it. Now, why and or how? Kind of the question of the hour. Wait, turns to the bar barkeep. Who's doing it? There's a group of people that live about half hour walk, not too far from town. Uh, because I've made a decision, I, she might actually do this. Mm -hmm. Can she read into the, the read inside this person a bit? Sure. Because, I'll say because Amos doesn't want to do it, he's going to do. The what same exactly thing. are you inciting? Just to see if, if if she's speaking like the whole truth. But I don't fucking know anything with that number, mm -hmm. so it don't yeah. matter, I suppose. Because that's a um, two almost, Because Amos <laughs> doesn't want to do it, he's going to be reading to see if she's telling the truth. Okay. Because he's hoping so she's not. Give me a roll. I rolled odds and evens to see if she would actually think to, like, uh, tell if they're hiding roll, anything. I just mean 18. Ooh. She seems to be telling you all she knows. That yep. was a 22 deception. Nice. <laughs> oh, snap. I don't know shit. Snowflake's gonna lean over, like, while she's, like, sipping, like, whatever beverage she has. Pre. Question hmm. for you. Shoot. What is undead? player has Swiss cheese one moment. Mm. Uh, uh, mm. My character does that a lot to people. I apologize. Yeah, it's fine. Uh, mm. Payback for the milk stuff. You, you listen. Okay. Uh, this will be interesting because, like, the, uh, the vampire hasn't done anything to give her the stereotype of what undead do. No. Yeah. Uh, effectively, and better definition pending. Those, uh, basically, it's something that was once alive, but it's no longer, and it's still somehow walking about. And that's a bad thing, why? I would have more. Right, I should have had a more ready response for something like this. Sorry, mm. <laughs> it's fine. It is fine. Typically, it's a disruption of the natural order. Things live, things die. Cycle. I think I remember. Someone talking about that. Player can't remember who. At this I think point. I think it was Cinder when we. Had I feel like about, it was Cinder, but when I we don't talked about remember. her village or something like that when she yeah. was explaining sadness. Yeah, I think it was Cinder and like the Zarvis conversation. I think. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I think so. All right. But hmm. she kind of looks a little like torn, a little confused at this point. She's kind of fiddling with her glass. But you can also be undead and be good, yes? I wouldn't discount the possibility. Right. She nods her head. 
takes a sip of beverage. Uh, the bodies outside on the square have a pulsing uh, or some sort of dark energy in the chest cavity where the heart should be. Sip. <laughs> That's <laughs> oh, really? Oh, uh, listening to this, like, what? <laughs> yeah, I bet. I don't. I imagine this is like just enough for those four to be able to talk, and nobody else on the other mm -hmm. side can hear this at the moment. Because mm -hmm. it was just like a question between, like, it, it was a question posed to know, like so Yeah, these two. These two. Just at the end, it. it's like, oh, BT Dub. <laughs> there's something. Mm -hmm. <laughs> there's something over there, by the way. I feel like Keldor's kind of just keeping the barkeep's attention at the moment. Fair, but mm. say, I'm I want you guys talk. Gonna be poking out. <laughs> don't don't mind Amos's token poking out the side of the building, but uh, <laughs> he's just thing. a big boy. Big boy. Yeah, yeah. You kind you kind of lean against the wall because there's actually no chair yeah. big enough for you. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, dark energy. He nods. Uh, hmm. I don't like that. Well, she did say dark magics were involved. Do we know if that's why everything is happening? Hmm, let's say high probability, friend. So if we get rid of that, we get rid of the problem. Hmm, one could hope, but there might be another source. We could possibly book around the gallows to see what's up. I okay, uh, she starts turning around to walk over. We're just supposed to be stopping for some supplies. Hold on, Cinder. Stop, mid-step. <laughs> we can't also, just go wandering out. I also have a sense of just... I can't pinpoint it, but an overall... magic. Mm. Not a positive one at that, either. Mm -hmm. It could be this. You said curse. I'm not quite sure what that is, but uh, I did also get uh, reading multiple points along the edge of the city. Too many to keep track of. But I, mean, I don't really have a way to get rid of it. <coughs> Seems that uh, whatever that is with the bodies is the central point. Hmm. Maybe she look at that. Look at that. And she looks at Cam. She's Almost. going to lean over past Amos and wave down Zarvis and try and motion him over. Hmm. Kind of. Yeah, she'll let him pass. Yeah, he'll kind of step over. Here. When she does, uh, while she's doing that, Amos is going to not so subtly cast Mage Armor on himself. Little <laughs> 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 oh, dear, kind of yeah. raises a hand. Yeah. I can go let the captain know that you guys will be late. Probably a good idea. Alright. And she kind of looks at Amos because she has to be let down because she's not jumping. <laughs> he'll, he'll, he'll set her down. E. Alright, I'll see you later. And she just kind of... Thank you, Valdera. Heads out. Yeah, so I'll put her back like over here. <laughs> yeah, right. Amos's AC is now 14. Hmm? Nice. Hmm. Ooh, that plus one though. Yeah, no. So, do you know how to get rid of bad energies, Arvis? Uh, DM looks at sheet. <laughs> <laughs> that is not a spell that I can get. Uh, I have removed curse, but this seems like a lot of points to do that. The most I can do is I can kind of shy and dead away. Hmm. Like you did with the ghosts. Mm hmm. I can tell you his spell is not high enough. To do this, <laughs> you know, yeah. it's a very powerful spell. Spell. Yeah. You know, oh. one thing I do kind of want to do before we go anywhere uh, much further with that. 
Hmm. See how much I can look into it. I'm gonna switch the music because. Yay. I was actually mm -hmm. thinking maybe we should first start off with the gallo and then investigate just in general and see what we can find. Maybe we can figure out how they're doing this. And if we know how they're doing this, we can figure out how to stop it. Right? We can, but we need to be very careful. There have been other people trying to solve this problem, and they've all vanished. I'd like to see them try, and Kindling kind of puffs up. <laughs> hmm. Because I imagine, because I've based on the, on the on the the benefits of this area. She probably feels a little more strong because the fire magic's increased. It says on the thing, fire fire magic is stronger. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she, so she probably that. feels a little bit better. Yeah, being a fire Genasi. <laughs> Wait, it's Gana, right? Gahana? Yeah. Did I say that? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, none of like the the random stuff would happen unless you went like further inward. Yeah. yeah. Uh, which but the way this thing is set up, there would not be any of those specific dangers, other than don't run. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I, I imagine no other way, and this is just player, I imagine, like, if I went fucking giant wolf spider, I imagine I'd be fine. <laughs> because stick to things. Spider climb is bullshit. Yeah, te technically I would allow that, yeah. I would say they'd be able to stick to the surface. Spiders are creepy, but they're also because it's not like it's wet. It's just a really slick stone norm. So mm -hmm. yeah, and they spiders. Mm. Uh, imagine Cinder, however, is not going to have a happy time with stress and dash. <laughs> Thankfully, she's mostly ranged. And... You know, unless she goes animal. I like the music, uh, by the way. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> now that you guys have discovered things. <laughs> yes. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, I just mm -hmm. wish you would have waited for the rest of us to uh, agree to do something. Why? It sounds like fun. No, no, it doesn't. But Amos. But Cinder, dead people. Walking. I know. No. We could be heroes. I don't want to be a hero. You already are one. No, I'm not. To me, she smiles. You know, at the very least, before we commit uh, commit to something, I can at least look look into those gallows over there, see if it's even within our capabilities. Okay. Yeah, I'll uh, go with you on that. Alright. Ace okay, so Crab will just pick up, uh, pick up Mew and just place him on the table in front of him. Mm -hmm. or, yeah. or, eh. So I imagine these two head out here to yep. see if they can figure right things out. Mm -hmm. Kindling, keep an eye on them. Uh, I imagine Snowflake would go to just to point things, what she saw through Mew. Yeah. Uh, gotcha. Yeah. Kindling's just gonna circle above and just like keeping a general eye out. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Whoop, whoop. Nope. <sighs> kitty, come here, kitty. I can't like see through his eyes, but he can definitely. He can at least keep an eye out. <laughs> mm -hmm. yeah. He was told to you protect will, them. You will crawl. Yeah, up. for the yeah. yeah, for the first ten minutes of this whole looking in, like Crab will be doing a ritual cast of um detect magic. Mm -hmm. oh, okay, she'll get her out of the way then for that. But, to be like. A cat would easily be identified and separate from whatever. Yeah, I... <laughs> yeah. yeah, fair. <laughs> you have to like focus on on what you're trying to like. Yeah. It's so not gonna, like, doing, you. Yeah, well, Chris is doing that. What are these three still doing? I know Cam is AFK at the moment. Mm hmm. Almost does not know how to deal at the moment. Because we don't want to do it. I'm That's dead. fine. Keldor's been volunteered, man. He's not happy about this. 
Okay, to be fair, you know. so so were the ones who weren't there yet. I know. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's also why I almost was not happy about it. Sinister's just excited. Which is definitely which is the main reason. Going, okay, to before be fair, we commit to this shit, Zarvis Zarvis has said that he wouldn't. He didn't really want to not figure out what was going on. But Obvious. at the same time, he wouldn't force people if they didn't want to. If if they're, they're, she knows that you know Amos is nervous, it's not. It's, it's that's I'm sure it's pretty apparent at this point. If it's something we can't handle, they'll know, and we won't do it. We'll say so. Mm-hmm. Besides, um, I don't know. I feel I just like helping people. That's all. Almost opens up a notebook and writes down, "Note to self: Don't leave Bard alone." <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Don't let Bard make decisions for entire group. Fair. Uh, because now they'll look like dicks if they don't look into it. I feel like, because I understand why Amos is upset, and I imagine, and that's the reason why I'm not, but I'm like, how would Cinder feel? Cinder's just excited. <laughs> See, he, you know, he, he's not upset in the fact, he's not upset with the fact like he's angry. No, he he's scared. He doesn't want to deal with it. Oh yeah, that's, not that's a perfect response. That, that's the logical response, honestly. Mm -hmm. Cinder is not a logical person. <laughs> no, no, she's not. She's like, oh, cool. <laughs> Something we can do. And explore the town more. So I'm just scared by the beam over there typing. It's fine. Yeah, it's fine. Oh, no, I'm just letting him know what he gets from the detect magic while you guys talk. Hmm. Cinder is just kind of. Like... You said you said you can't swim, right? I didn't say that. Yeah, you did. No, I didn't. Well, you, you said you'd rather go on a boat and said and you couldn't swim. I said that'd be if I couldn't swim. <laughs> She's gonna insight. Even though she knows. I wasn't gonna try and roll deception. <laughs> Ah, uh, that's a number. That's a what? That's above a 20. That's above a 20? 20? 23 to be some size. Oh, shit. My natural 2018 doesn't do shit, then. <laughs> <laughs> it's a fan, I'm sorry. You know. Aww. <laughs> the natural I mean, she, she knows you can't swim, to be fair. She's just trying to figure out whether or not you said it or not. He said it. She kind of looks at you. Yeah, you did. Like, Don't worry. I have water walk, remember? And underwater breathing spell I can cast. But that won't matter if we're going after zombies and stuff. Well, yeah, so you won't have to worry about that. Oh, I do have, and she kind of like... I can summon some animals. Great, tough ones. Uh, let's see. I can make a flaming blade... I can make an explosion. Kind of walks over <laughs> at this point. He kind of walks over at this point. 
really wishing he didn't hear that. <laughs> I, can, I can make an explosion. Uh. Uh, okay. Should we head outside and get ready to go deal with this? I'd rather go back to the boat, but you know. Same though. But don't I feel worry. like I don't have a choice. Neither do I. And I know Cam isn't here, but he's just gonna give her this smile of like, hate you for a moment. <laughs> for now. Shows, shows, killed, shows killed George the page in his notebook. <laughs> Yeah, you know, that's just a good note on us in general. That's <laughs> a good note on us in general. <laughs> I know, I'm well aware so far. Although I try not to throw myself at things that could kill me. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll keep you alive. Just walks out. Mm. <laughs> good. You know, he will wait out here. For everybody, basically. Um, yeah, I safe. will I will wait till Aspire actually gets back, though, before any information is revealed. Uh, he steps uh, out the door. He can't, can't go any farther out the door. Would swoop back down and land, basically. Yeah, it's fine. Drag has some interesting information with that spell. Yep. It's fine. Don't worry. Honestly, it's I technically did roll, I did, two parts to it. I did roll perception for kindling as there's a ground, but I didn't say anything because that was a no. Yeah, you know. uh, because it's a bit more obvious now. You do see occasionally people kind of glance over, but they kind of, they immediately seem to wander off and not want to mm. stick around. Yeah, because uh, hi, well, welcome, back. welcome back. So, yes, Keljor right. gave you this smile of, I hate you for the moment. <laughs> uh, okay. Amos has dedicated one whole page in his notebook to, do not leave the bar to make decisions for the group. Yeah, he showed Keljor that, and he said, oh, that's just a good note on us in general. Uh, <laughs> See, Amos isn't mad. He's not mad. He's just scared. He's not, dis he's not disappointed. Yes, he's terrified. So You're forcing him into something he doesn't want to do. There's two people that technically have learned something. Mm -hmm. Would you like to start drag, or would you like me to start? Uh, I would say you can go ahead, because I feel like his would take less time to figure out than mine. No, Zarvis didn't do anything. I'm talking about the one who's been sitting oh. there talking to the barkeep this whole time. Oh. Uh, yeah, I'll I let him some, go first. I made so a roll while he was sitting over there. Nice. <sighs> well, she's definitely hiding something. Hmm? She seems uneasy about telling any more information than she has to. Interesting. Mm, I'm sure it's a safety matter. Safety oh, or she knows why. a lot more than what's actually been said. Well, I said, if she doesn't give us information, we go back to the boat. <laughs> I can see why she would be, though. Hmm. This curse, it's... So... Well, it's... Beat it's your... definitely... What, drug? Necromancy definitely at play here. Okay. And, like this, that's... never seen one this strong so either it's multiple people or <sighs> and then there's what it does the victims aren't made sick they're literally drained over time hmm so something is feeding from the looks of this, it's definitely be a, been around a lot longer than the month month the sickness started. If I read that correctly, a couple months is when the first case actually was. All right, all right. Well, so based on the wording, uh, from the looks of it, it looks like this has been a thing since before the first symptoms were shown. Mm-hmm. Okay. That in translation. <laughs> I probably took a bit for symptoms to start showing up. 
usually if, uh, when an animal or a person gets sick, they might not show symptoms for at least a while, depending on what it is. And if this is not quite sickness, but being drained, it might be something similar. Might be. Or maybe it took a while to set up. Sounds kind of like uh, they're weakening them so they do die. Yeah. I want to try something. Hmm. How about it? He's going to point his hand towards the gallows. And he's going to cast a spell magic. Okay. Roll me a d20 with your spell modifier. That is a 21. It does not work. Okay, so uh, I'm going back to the boat. <laughs> <laughs> At your current levels, I'm sorry to say, it will not work. <laughs> oh, good. I want to go back to the boat. I think we just need to find whoever's doing it. Okay, I'm going to put this in simpler terms so everybody understands. That did not work. I want to go back to the boat. That's you fair. Don't, you don't have to go with us, you know? Hmm, it's true. Only one I'm forcing is Kaljor over here. <laughs> to be fair, they know who's part of your group after we went in there. So if people don't go, they look like dicks. Uh, not necessarily. I mean, we or did wimps. kind of arrive with a ship full of people. It doesn't mean everybody would go. It's true. People still have to watch the ship, after all. If things We're get to be too much, I mean, we can always turn around and leave. If whatever's doing this lets us. It's a question of whatever's doing this can even even consider us a threat. Okay. Well, I guess that's slightly less if it's not the group of them. Well, it depends. They did say that anybody that went to investigate it specifically was the ones that disappeared. What if we just acted like normal travelers? Would that actually make a difference? He's going to turn around and walk back into the tavern. Mm-hmm. And go to the barkeep. She'll look up at him. Um, I'm sorry to bother you about this, but, uh... Have any normal travelers gone missing, uh, in certain areas around here? Well, not that I'm aware of, but they also don't necessarily return if they're traveling. Ah. So that's not something I could tell you. Uh, it is an unusual for uh, people to come through and then just leave. Uh, I'm trying to. I'm debating something. Mm hmm. Uh, I hate Insider. After Keldor said she was hiding something before, mm -hmm. this would prompt him to fact check a lot of stuff she's saying. Sure. Uh, and that is a 23. I like the definition. 27. That is a fact checked. Fuck. <laughs> she's got a plus 10 to her deception, man. Oh, no. Damn. 
He leaves. You probably still get the feeling that even if she did know, she was not going to tell you. Well, it's not like anybody around here is going to be reliable for information, so. Oh, how this? If you want, I can go wandering around. No. What? You're not wandering around by yourself. I can turn into an animal and go away. I am always one for a body system. Especially in dangerous places like this. To be fair, we have no idea what we're dealing with. We don't know if it's people, if it's demons. What is it? That is something that was not mentioned. Oh. <sighs> they just said a family or a group or whatever. Did they say where? <sighs> a thirty-minute thirty minute walk from town, I believe. They did, however, we're not all going to be going there. I think that would look a little odd, don't you think? I'll go. I <sighs> I mean, if we're just a traveling group, I guess it wouldn't be that weird. <laughs> maybe, anybody who is. maybe try not to show signs of aggression and hope that they don't attack. I'm not aggressive. No, I feel like they wouldn't attack you unless they're just dicks. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I don't want you guys to go either. If we don't well, want to be seen, I can make it a little easier. No, I don't want you guys to go. You've been the nicest to me of anybody. Oh. And I don't want you all to die. Go and die. I'll make sure that doesn't happen, alright? That includes you, Sargus. <laughs> Just nervous laugh. <laughs> I will be more on. I'll make sure if things go wrong, I'll put out a healing spirit as well. Okay, I'm just, go ahead. Just, just one more thing. If things do go wrong, we can all gather around Kingling. And they can teleport us away. There. Uh, which you haven't seen them do once, which is basically, I think it's every creature within five feet of my choice can teleport. Oh, that's mm. cool. Up to 30 feet of the spot from where it can see. And any creature within 10 feet of the spot from where they teleported from must make a dex save or take fire damage. As oh, it explodes. Nice. <laughs> oh, that's interesting. It's called fiery teleportation. It's fine. That's I'm fun. curious to see how you guys will handle this. Um. Almost already isn't. <laughs> you know. That's a fair <laughs> response. Out of character, if y'all want to do the sneaky sneak, Snowflake can do Pass Without Trace. Mm. Cool. But yeah. she can only do it once per day. So. It would Diane. probably be a recommendation to wait till you're closer to do that. Not, yeah, just yeah. offering the spell up. It is a very open terrain, so it is still kind of hard to stealth. If you do look like outside of the towns, because it, it's just a mountain, flat mountain surface. Mm. But if they don't see you coming because they are inside or whatever, because you imagine there's a building. <laughs> yeah, family building. Mm -hmm. Family group, not sure which yet. Almost sends Nubby to the pocket dimension. Oh, bye Nubby. Uh, bye uh, Nubby. Reason. I love how I still have the cat on Zarvis' shoulder there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I I've been moving her around <laughs> different tokens, so yeah, Mew's just gonna be floating around. Uh, for now. Snowflake is going okay. to. While everybody is about to, I mean, starting to walk off, Snowflake's gonna hang behind for a second. 
And she's going to walk up to the gallows, crawl up, without touching the source that she saw. She's just going to try to get a reading for her for her battery to try to just, I guess, for science, just collect a little bit of energy from it. Hmm. Because that's data. You know. You know, I'm curious to see how well this will go. Roll me an arcana. Okay. If Hello, D twenties. Where are it you? It is a. If it is high enough, you will learn something. Cool. It's mainly just data collecting, just for you know, studying the planes. But we'll see. Oh, that's actually not bad. Let's see. Uh. <laughs> Do, 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 do. I think that that's a plus three, which that'll make it an 18. Okay. I will type to you what she gets. Ooh. Cool. Knowledge! Mm -hmm. Was uh, Amos. Was Amos just sending a bit of the pocket dimension to keep him safe? Uh huh. That's fair. Yeah, Mew's going else. there shortly. <laughs> there, there, there's gonna be something else, but uh, we'll see as far as who's all paying, who, who's gonna lag behind the group as they exit town. Because he'll do something as they exit town. Yeah. Snowflake might notice that she's hanging behind, so. Yep. We'll and I'll straight up tell you what it is. Well, I'll go ahead and say it out loud. He vanishes. Oh, no. That is very fair. He casts invisibility. <laughs> Mm -hmm. It's all town just <laughs> That's just fair, it doesn't last an hour. Yes it does. Yeah. <clears throat> Me's gonna go hang out with Nubby in the pocket dimension. <laughs> <laughs> Here's the thing. Mm -hmm. Best part about invisibility, you can't see how terrified he is. No. That is fair. It's like hanging no. in a shower. But animals can smell it. With invisibility, can you still see footprints? Like, I imagine just like like these half giant footprints. Like, oh wait, no, it's like a it's, it's mountainside. Never mind. You ain't seeing shit. You ain't seeing shit. There you go, Sean. Thank you. Yeah, I imagine since there's probably more in the front, essentially. <laughs> oh, that's interesting. Mm -hmm. This is fair. That is very fair. That is fair. And we've uh, taken one of their own. The message is limited in range. Remember this. Yep. Um, I think she's someone sending. Yeah, I think she keeps saying message. Yeah. Oh. Uh, Keldor also has sending. Well, that's right. Not proud with that. Uh. So Snowflake will catch up with the group. And she, I guess she sees what uh, Amos did. Mm -hmm. And she'll just, uh, I guess, just like, you know, run up. And just where he vanished. Like, she doesn't know, but she's going to just try to put a hand on his back. She she doesn't know where he is, but like, she's just going for where she vanished and trying to guess and just put a hand up on his back and just pat, pat. There, there is a high probability she misses the back and might touch his butt. There's a high probability. High possibility because he's about ten feet. He's somewhere between. What did I say his height was? Let me see. Description. Which will also work really well. It's like you know in sports, the whole like. You can do it. Good job, Pat Pat. <laughs> like, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> it's 
fun. Good job. Whack! <laughs> Support a butt tap. <laughs> Support a butt tap. <laughs> okay, he's about 10 foot tall, so... She's 5 foot 3. The possibility she smacks the butt. Okay. She's literally half his height. <laughs> okay, let's let's just do this. <laughs> Odds or evens, Jay. I don't know. Because no context. <laughs> Butt pats. Nothing? I don't know. Fine. I'll just say just odds. Working. Odds. She touches the butt. Oh no. I rolled a three. Oh, okay. She touches the butt. That is butt. But why, though? <laughs> <laughs> Touchy spells and butt pats are now shut up. <laughs> to the You're welcome. You know? Um, I finally actually filled out his uh, description thing. It's fine. I want her to touch my dice. That sounds oddly sexual. That yes. was well timed. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> um, so you get patted on the butt. <laughs> he looks down. Keeps walking. <laughs> she don't know what she touched. <laughs> well, you know he was there. <laughs> yeah. He was. What? <laughs> <It> was? <laughs> God. It was. Feel, feel and leave your hand. He has, he has a 35 foot boob machine. He was there. Yeah. <laughs> right. So anything happened while you guys are walking there? Because it'll be a little, it'll be a little bit of a travel. Cinder's just keeping an eye up, mostly because it's an interesting area. That's fair. It all depends if they. You guys are kind of just walking along noticed. the coastline, basically. It all depends if everybody else notices the big guy's not there. Um, I'm sure Cinder notices with her passive is pretty decent that he's just gone, but she has seen him cast invisibility before. Because he's done that. Mm -hmm. I'm not on the square! Sorry. Because my passive is a plus 17. I imagine I noticed the 10-foot man vanish. <laughs> at some point, at least. <laughs> yeah. I think who she would say this to. Would it be a, like a perception check to like hear like his footfalls or something? I mean, hmm. Would you think of? Would she think of that though? I mean, yeah, you guys not know not he... being able to see him with the, well, a thing possibly. Here's the thing. Mm -hmm. I will say as well. You guys know he was adamant about not wanting to do this. This is true. That is fair. Him being hidden isn't, like, a bad thing. No. Yeah, they uh, Technically, like I said, Zarvis was not going to force him to go, so if he actually did sneak off, he wouldn't fault him for that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. No. So he's not yeah, paying I attention to her. Amos so just knows that he's not there at the moment, so she's never... Either he's invisible or he's not here. That's where her mindset would be. Mm-hmm. She Only imagines... Snowflake knows the truth because she touched his butt. Yes. <laughs> Cinder, here's the way Cinder would say, like, she, if we get into a situation, she's sure we'll find out if he's here or not. That is fair. Maybe. Uh... One way or another. <laughs> Panic squeak. <laughs> yeah, I think she would... I was trying to think who she would tell this to. Hmm? Mm. Gonna go over to Cinder. She'd probably be walking Hi. by you, Cray. That's fair. Uh, she... Uh, approaches and... Um... So, you... You taught me... About... Joy, sadness, mm -hmm. pain, anger. Um, I'm confused. And she kind of is like 
rinse her eyes a little bit. What's the matter? Well, I I can learn uh, magic from absorbing or observing. Mm -hmm. uh, I went and tried to learn from whatever that essence was back there. And I'm confused. I didn't get a magic from it. Well, it was magic, but I didn't sense what type of magic it was. It was, I felt sadness and I felt pain and and she kind of like fiddles with her fingers for a little bit remember how I told you about the echoes mm -hmm. it's kind of like that like there's like like an echo of a, a thing in there like, it's still there. But there's another sense. I don't know what it is. It's like pain. A lot of pain. I don't know. Pain that's like forced. I don't know the word. Pain that's forced. Like over and over again. They're kind of things. And she'll. Cause I don't know if she. I don't know if she'd actually know the word for this. As player, I'm pretty sure I know what the word is. Mm -hmm. But yeah. sooner being an innocent being. Yeah, she doesn't know the. She. The, yeah, I'm trying to describe the word without. But yeah. yeah. <clears throat> she would probably. Maybe Cam would help. And she'll scoop over to watch our cam. Mm -hmm. This cam's a Bart. And Bart's no knowledge. And Keldor, because Keldor's right there too, to be fair. So yeah, she'll point lean over to both of them. So. I am uh, a Bart. <laughs> 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 Apparently, Snowflake uh, absorbed some of the magic. Some. It's weird. I don't know that that well. I don't understand that kind of magic. I understand the nature magics, but I don't understand that kind of magic. It's different to me. But it's, it's cool. Ah, anyways. Science chart. Uh, where was I? Oh, right. <laughs> uh, just raise an eyebrow. <laughs> she says she felt sadness, uh, pain, Almost like echoes of something, somebody there in there still. And like pain caused over and over and over again. I don't know the word for that. Do you? Hmm. Something trapped there. Spirits, or torture, suffering, maybe. Torture or suffering? Maybe they're souls tormented. Are yeah, it's possible. How long have those been there? Uh, the bodies, I think, were been there for a while. They looked old. Hmm. I mean, if they've been trapped there that long. Yeah. Any of those words technically fit. Okay. Uh, 
<laughs> she wanted to get the word. <laughs> so strapped and tortured as she's like, as she hears that as she's walking away. <sighs> this is the word could we ever be tormented, torture, or suffering. Maybe the souls are trapped? Being forced to be in pain? Maybe. I've never sensed an emotion when trying to read magic. That's what was weird. Maybe the, the magic... She turns and will step back because she just had a thought and goes to service. Service. Mm hmm. Is it possible for this magic to be caused by a tormented soul? Hmm. And she'll kind of explain the same thing that she just explained to Keldor, basically. Uh, depending on how long that magic was sitting there, it's possible there was a power source based on that. If there was enough uh, energy coming off of those bodies, then yeah, it is possible. Maybe they used of those souls? No, Whatever I didn't think to... I didn't even think to ask why those were sitting there. It is kind of weird that they're hanging. It's really weird. Well, it means that something happened and they were put to death. Maybe that's why this is happening? It's possible. We didn't actually. We didn't actually ask about any of the other victims, did we? Mm -hmm. Oh. Hmm. Interesting. And they are basically the center, so I guess it makes sense. There are so many things I almost would want to ask right now. <laughs> but he's invisible, so he's holding back asking anything. I feel like he's listening that into all the, these yeah, convos. Yeah, that was the other person that uh, Snowflake was wanting to talk to, but he's invisible. <laughs> sure, he was. It's Cinder and Amos. <laughs> There's, uh, teacher of magic and teacher of emotion. Right. There's definitely a lot more going on here than I can even begin to imagine. We probably should have asked about that. Fuck it, he would. Yeah, instead of rushing to do it, we should have looked into it more, right? Vamos! <laughs> oh, here, you are here. Do we want to return back? Is that smarter? I don't know. Well, I mean, we're already on the way, I guess. Up to you guys if you actually want to take the time to go back and then retravel if we have to. I mean, I have a lot of energy. If anything, I can get oh. coffee. Oh no! Don't. <laughs> no. no. <laughs> Heard that one horribly. Please no. <laughs> you know, I, I, I hyper tender that I could probably do nothing but a run in a place like this would probably be the, um, probably be a bad idea. Please no. Yeah. As DM's like, do it. <laughs> do it. <laughs> do it. <laughs> what could possibly go wrong yeah. giving the Slope. hyped up fucking <laughs> never druid slope. with fire magics oh, caffeine slope that you'll bounce down forever and ever and ever? Is that forever? Oh, I'll hit the water first at some point. Eventually. Ronico. I'll let you hug a building. <laughs> 
<laughs> no hugging building. <laughs> yeah, so, I might hug a building eventually. So the question is now, do you guys choose to head back or do you choose to continue to see if you can even see what's going on? Or at least see what the source is. So we're so, leaving it up to the deciders, which was the two back in the back and Cam. So those are the three that seem to be most adamant on this. Zarvis will say he doesn't think they will get much information out of the townsfolk, unfortunately. Yeah, Cinder's going to kind of agree that she's because they have been hiding things. To be fair, I almost was being sarcastic when you said uh, we should have probably did that, right? Yeah. Yeah, fair. I mean, Keldor probably caught that. Zarvis does not catch on to sarcasm very well. <laughs> Neither does Cinder. Yeah. <laughs> you know? There's not sarcasm in the animal country. Snowflakes <laughs> just went, got excited that he, she heard his voice because she was wanting to share with him the knowledge she gained. So that's why she went over there. And so. He picks her up. Is Tell he still George. invisible? Tell George <laughs> is basically following Cam's lead because that's what he was forced to do. So. <laughs> Hi. He got he got word for your man. Look, man, he shouldn't have said the things he said if he didn't want them to get used. Yeah, he's learning this, be... and now he's going to be more careful with his wording. But I feel like it's still going to be used. Cam <laughs> could also get word lord in the fact of he did probably did not mean with undead involved. Yeah, but well, he didn't think of that. Sure. Nah. But he did say that he was going to try to keep her safe. Mm hmm. He was all flirty about it, too, so might as well. To be fair, at the same time, he probably didn't think she would throw herself at going dealing with undead either. At the field. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> to be fair, his only thought process is maybe I can impress her. I don't know. Yeah. That's kind of his thought process. And, <laughs> like, maybe I'll do something to impress her. <laughs> it's true. Don't worry. It's fine. It's hard to a bard. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <sighs> um, Snowflake, Snowflake's just gonna put her arms around like uh um uh uh Amos and just be like, I learned a new type of magic. One that conveys emotion. And she'll just basically tell him what she felt and everything. Oh uh, okay. Um <laughs> that makes them feel more comfortable. I know <laughs> it's it, it just not. But it's knowledge, it, and he it is it would be magic. But that was that. That was something that I was curious about. Would you guys actually ask why are those bodies hanging there? <laughs> yeah, Cinder would not even. To be honest, Snowflake wouldn't. No. <laughs> yeah, Keldor didn't want to do this. Zarvis didn't think of that because he was more focused on figuring out what the problem was. I almost didn't want to yeah, do this. Yeah, same. <laughs> Weird planar thing hanging people in the middle of the square. It's fine. Yeah. Normally, you would it's... take down the bodies after a while, or you'd leave them up as a warning. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Cam honestly probably thought it was more of a warning situation and just figured she wouldn't ask. <laughs> uh, Found out the townsfolk were too afra uh, afraid to uh, take it down with that with them being the focal point of a curse. Yeah, that never occurred to her until now. <laughs> Either yeah, too that, afraid to take him down. Until, wait a minute. <laughs> either too afraid to take him down, or who knows why they're suffering. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Were they accused of something they didn't do? Who knows? Cam's gonna suggest that just <laughs> due to the fact that they're already on their way over, they try and see what they can find out. And if they can get a little bit more of information just about the town in general, about these this family that seems to be at the center of it, before going back and confronting the barmaid. That way they have some ammunition, like, we have more information, we know you're hiding something, kind of thing. That way it's, now we have two sides to the story, because she thinks there might be multiple sides to everything going on. I don't care if she's involved. Hmm? Oh, mm -hmm. likely. 
Cinder just wants to talk to these people. That's all Cinder wants to do. It's always the bar. Is she involved or did she cause it? Help cause it? (laughs) Yeah. Yeah. The answer to that question is Aaron Julia. Yes. (laughs) The answer to that question is she's the ringleader of all of them. Why, Why this town? Why do they want them to suffer? We'll find out. After these messages. <laughs> <laughs> Brought to you. So you guys, so you guys keep going. Spots. Or do you go back? I, I so. keep going. I think we're keeping going. I think they are. Yeah. I feel like we're. I feel like if we go as a player, if we go back, even if we ask, we're not going to get a certain sort of answer. No. No. Not right now. Kim at least knows the language this tavern owner probably speaks, which is gold, but it's even better when you compare gold with I already know some things, so you better be telling me the truth. Yeah. Strengthen the defense before going back. Fair. Sondra is planning on talking to these people. (laughs) No. That, you know... So as as you continue on, unless there's any other... Mm-hmm. I was, Keldra said they won't attack her unless they're dicks. That's fair. <laughs> <laughs> he's not wrong, though. <laughs> oh, no, he's not. With how she is. <laughs> uh, so you guys been traveling quite a bit. You're about five minutes. You could see a structure in the distance. We want a what? stealth mode. Yeah, go ahead and also make perception checks if you want to also roll yeah. stealth. Cast pass without a trace. <laughs> okay. You know, what's, you know what's beautiful about this, by the way. <laughs> Not only does Amos get a plus ten because of pass without a trace, he also gets advantage because he's invisible. That is fair. Yep. Noise. Oh, that uh, perception is plus not 10, good. Right? Mm-hmm. What is my yeah. stealth? Right, I'm not proficient in that. Twenty-five stuff. I'm just gonna put both of theirs in the yeah. chat so you guys have an idea. Perception. Yeah. Because they are not the best with stealth, but you know, it's the pass without a trace will help. Yeah. And I also have to make another roll, so it's fine. Wait. <laughs> no, I did that perception wrong. That's actually. I roll a twelve plus seven. That's not seventeen. You know, that is fair. Um, wait, wait. I wrote a twelve. How? I, wait. <laughs> okay, and I need to check something really quickly because. Da, 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 da. Hmm? I like I like past trace. Right? That plus ten is just beautiful. Mm-hmm. You know what's even more beautiful? Mm. When your character already has a plus seventeen to stealth. Who how? You know? That's insane. <laughs> no, no, he doesn't. Oh. Did. Oh, uh, I was like, what? <laughs> so, no. yeah. They don't notice you, but as you guys are kind of looking around the area a bit as you're walking, you do notice someone a little further down kind of throwing rocks into the water. He's just kind of sitting there a bit, uh, not too far from that place. He doesn't mm. look that old. He only looks about maybe 16. Mm. Out of character, the temptation to lightning bolt in the back into the water is there. <laughs> you oh know. Boy. That's aggressive. Oh boy. Okay, he's near a structure that they, people have that the barkeep said was apparently where the undead energy and stuff he rolled a nat one on his perception. He has not noticed you guys at all. You know, Cinder is like probably sneaking, but like chittering, like she wants to go talk. Mm-hmm. He doesn't seem like he'd be harmful. He looks like a, he, he's still a kid. She's like looking back at Cam, looking over at the guy, looking at the camp. <laughs> Oh no! <laughs> Out of character, real quick. That uh-huh. quote. Um. Yeah. If almost was the lightning bolt. <laughs> oh God. That's if it. That's if it killed him on the first hit. 
<laughs> if he doesn't, if he doesn't see us, he has disadvantage on a deck save. Yeah, but you don't know how much HP he has. I know it scares me. I, I rolled to it. see which one would be sitting there. Uh, I don't like that. Oh, it's a kid. Yeah, and so yeah. is like, can I, can I, can I? Uh. That seems like a really bad idea, but... It is. It's a, probably a very bad idea. <laughs> Can be made better if I, uh, I stalk him. <laughs> yeah. Buddy system, man. Buddy system. Yeah. It's one of those, like, part of me really, 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 really wants to see what happens if Cinder approaches the goth kid. <laughs> uh, <laughs> you know. <laughs> you know. Oh, goodness. She's gonna motion back over to Kra. Like, come over here. Yeah. But they says, but sure, Cinder. Can you try her, Kra? Why are you changing? Can music? attempt. Don't worry about it. Why are you changing music, though? <laughs> Brenda, why'd you change music? <laughs> <laughs> he rolled that one. Yeah, huh? Okay. Why you probably, music? Probably, she'll, she'll probably stop and because imagine Chris like trying to be more hidden. I don't know. She's <laughs> right behind I, me. You know? Yeah, I feel like it'd be more like a. That's a good distance. I think. Okay. You're, you're basically hiding behind a rock. Excellent. So they're just waves. He kind of glances back at you. Hi? How are you? I... Just smiling. Kind of okay. stand up and turn to face you. I'm um, all right. My name's Cinder. What's yours? Uh, Hawkel. Hawkel. Okay. That's a really cool name. I like that name. This is Kindling. You're an energetic one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm not gonna make him reroll perception. He just kind of looks around. <laughs> yeah. So, are you here by yourself? I have kindling. Right. So, no? <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> Even if he insights that, she's not actually lying! <laughs> it's her. She's wise. Mm-hmm. <laughs> And I think her intelligence is what? Oh yeah, her intelligence is a 14. She's smart. So what are you doing all the way out here? Checking things around. I was really curious about this place. Everything's like in a slant. That's very cool. Yeah. I feel like you're going to get yourself hurt. <laughs> Mm. Mm. What are you doing here? I live over there, and he kind of points over the structure. Oh. Sierra the family lives there. You see him kind of sink into himself a little bit as he stares at you. That's right, cool. Mm. I don't know what's going on, I'll be honest. They say things, but I don't know what's going on. And I don't really necessarily like... I'm sure people are saying things about me right now. And that those things aren't true. So I don't know what's going on. 
You know? Roll me a persuasion real quick. With how you're wording that. Good. That's a <laughs> great stat for her. So yep. 14 minus 1. 13. That's okay. He's not the greatest with it either. Or the wisdom saves. <laughs> you know? Uh, yeah, you really shouldn't believe everything they say. She nods. He seems to relax a little mm. bit, though. Do you <laughs> mind if we get your side? Well, if you're not from there, it's really none of your business. I know. I just want to make sure things are right. Mm -hmm. For everyone. And that includes you. <laughs> yeah, you put her in the thing. Oh, it's fine. Yeah. Mm. It's fine. I've just been debating to do an either out thing. You know. This is where we die. All you need to know is we had our reasons, okay? Is it because of what they did? He just looks down. She nods. I... I have my fair share of troubles. And she kind of, she'll pull out her druid notebook. You can see it's just charred on the edges. I lost a lot. And I don't know much about that. I, I assume I did it, but I don't know. Um, I I don't want to push too much but is it was something the ones in the middle were they the doesn't town wrong them I have to check something real quick. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, goody. She's just trying to get whatever knowledge she can. Yeah. Let's see. Before he gets to answer, uh, make more perception checks from the ones sure. in the back here. I take it this is not counting cred because keep an eye on that situation. Uh, yeah, if you're just watching these two, then no. All right. Okay. Uh, your perception sucks, sir. 
So does yours, apparently. <laughs> yeah, those two don't notice. You two don't notice. <laughs> I wonder if it's fire now. This is. Wait, yeah. who doesn't notice? You guys don't. Oh, great. Mm -hmm. I think it rolls a 24, so if it was higher than that, yeah, there's no chance. Uh, you know. Let me see. Am I rolling another perception or. Yeah. You're seeing if you uh, could spot what what is going to happen before it happens. Uh, I'm going to use my luck on this. Because <laughs> okay. that was a crap roll. <sighs> ah, that's much, much better. Because she is watching intently on the children that have gone off on their own. Uh, <laughs> 22 in perception. Nope. Nope. Because uh, didn't either. No. Oh no. Oh no. Was it higher than twenty-four? Cheese. So let me just double check this. Da, 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 da. I'm afraid. Was it higher than twenty-four? It was. Oh yeah, there's no chance in hell. This was the the one that didn't have the good stealth. <laughs> You know? If if I got, like, a couple higher. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I want to say he called it not going to this. Fair. And player called it in chat, this is where we die. N no. He, not start sure it'll be he starts to say None something. Like he's going to give you an answer? Mm-hmm. And a firebolt explodes in front of, like, between you two. And you look oh, over gee. and you see two more people walking over. Hi! Which one casted the firebolt? It was, uh, the, this one. Right here. Okay. Sinner just kind of waves with a smile. They just kind of motion for him to walk back over, and he reluctantly kind of walks over to them. And that's where we'll... that <laughs> oh. that's where we'll call it. <laughs> oh no! It's gonna turn center to that because she would have faced in that direction now. Yeah. Yeah. Don't worry. Oh, no. Cinder's fine. Snowflake yeah, you know. is I about will say, to Cinder, you get the feeling like he does want to tell you mm. what his, but the other two called him away before he could. Because mm. you got the, you got lucky and got the youngest brother, who is not the best with keeping this hidden. You know. Oh, I want to point out something. Guess what? Hmm. We already did what we had said we weren't going to do. What? Make it obvious investigating it. Yeah, so there's no. not subtle. No. No. Yeah. Which was my concern in sending Cinder over, but I was also like, uh, but Cinder's the best person. She is like, no, to be fair, she. I give you this with player knowledge. She actually worded things really well with him mm -hmm. because he was able to relate to something she said mm -hmm. and would you like to know what that was uh was it when she pulled out her book and she pulled, pulled out the the chard thing and said that she doesn't know <laughs> if she's the one that caused it mm -hmm. but she lost people she cared about Yeah, that's that's where I thought I got it, and I was like, you know, the reason she said it because they look she similar, has... so you can tell there's yeah. a relation. <laughs> yeah, like face wise. Do they look like like parents to a child or siblings? They look not too far apart in age, so you can imagine siblings. Okay, he seems to be the youngest. 
looking out of the three. So yeah. Question though. <laughs> Have they actually noticed us? They did not. They were focused on Cinder, and, like somebody in front of their brother, basically. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Good. I didn't say that we'd be rolling initiative. They just wanted to separate them. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that is fair. Yeah. And Cinder's just waving and being friendly. Mm. I'm sure and... Snowflake knows a hundred percent what a warning shot means. Yeah, that was a warning shot. <laughs> yeah, she knows what that is. Does not at all know what that is. I know. I'm gonna make sure they don't engage because she knows what a warning shot is. <laughs> or you best let Snowflake know before she runs in and starts. I feel like shit. because Zarvis is next to you, he would at least put his hand on your shoulder. Oh yeah, because she's like, is she, that's why I asked. I was like, who, <laughs> who threw the fireball? <laughs> because yeah. I imagine so like you Snowflake. Could've... like. From what like you rears tell. down, ready to like run in. Yeah, from what you could tell, it looks like he is the the youngest. This one is the oldest. Mm. If yeah, you if you were trying to guess their ages. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, Zarva's gonna start. attempt to hold you back. We'll see how that yeah. goes. Yeah. Depends how aggressive no, they get. knows somebody tried to attack uh, Cinder. And That's just, probably the least thing. The, honestly, the probably least threatening thing you could throw at Cinder. Yeah. Fire? Yeah. Fire bolt. Oh no. Fire. My weakness. That depends on what, that depends on what level they are, though, Fluffy. Mm -hmm. I'm also resistant still. Honestly, yeah. Ford, okay, you may be resistant, but. Well, I'm sure they are aware. Have, it's still, uh... you, do, you are an obvious fire genasi. I'm sure they're yeah. aware you're resistant. Which could and mean fine. multiple things. If it had hit her, maybe they weren't intending to hurt her. Mm -hmm. That much. Could mean that. To be fair, though, if they're high enough for 4d10, we're still level 5. They have, have that's, still, that's still a big dent. Okay, look, I did balance this one a bit. <laughs> they are different levels, have... is all I'll give mm. you. That's fair. I, I will... <laughs> I, I will say, Cam is ready to go run in and be troop mom and take care of things if it looks like things could go down very badly in de-escalated situation, but... We'll have to oh. see how Cinder handles this, I guess. Yeah, she's hoping Cinder is able to do so. Cinder's just being gonna be friendly. Because that's what Cinder does, that's who Cinder is. Snowflake is not going to understand what the fuck is going on right now. I'm sure it's fine. I almost wants to walk away from this. We'll see. Yeah. It also depends if he decides to attempt to convince them to back off. Yep. She's also, by the way, I'm just going to put this out there. She's not, like, holding any weapons out, so she doesn't technically have her shield. Yeah. Oh, it's fine. But she does have the book out. Yeah. So, this will be fine. We'll figure out what happens. Yep. What could so possibly go wrong? I'm so, sure. it's fine. Yeah. It's fine. And with that, bye, stream. Bye. 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 <laughs>